All right, sorry about that. The battery died. Well, part two. Part two is that we uh, we will laugh at you. <laughs> what what'd you get? He's just saying something about uh, somebody in Venezuela. Yeah, I don't know if the last part had it. Got it, but uh, Venezuela, they, I said the nurses and I think, I think it was teachers and shit like that. They they started selling their ass and shit. Cause, you know, it was famine going on. And then uh, I seen a video. Bitch, she was selling the ass on the same corner as the other bitch. And the bitch got went crazy and started slashing the face up. Hey. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's a, that's a fucking nurse and a teacher selling their ass. Nurses and teachers selling their ass. Oh, we got teacher uh, daycares are shutting down. So, that's all those women working in daycares. They, they just lost their job. They ain't get no income. Okay. Daycares are shutting down. School teachers. He got school teachers panicking if they gonna get paid. But I know a school teacher, and he was just talking about it. He's like, I don't know if they're gonna pay us. Uh, a lot of people, lose, like I said, the bars are shutting down, restaurants are shutting down. Everybody losing their jobs, bro. I've already seen women panicking. I already know one woman. She uh, said that they, she's already lost her job because she was getting paid under the table. You know, a lot of these mom and pop restaurants. They're not doing everything exact according to the books because it's impossible to run a business. You gotta pay people under the table and shit to survive. They all kind of people losing their jobs, bro. Uh, the scripture, the last scripture we said, uh, we have programs are gonna be probably in the woods and shit. In the wilderness. Like, like, uh, yeah, in the wilderness and talk about. And that's Matthew 24. He said, talk about, we gotta flee to the mountains. Pray it's not winter. Hey, at least we're going into the good season, right? You know, like I said, it's almost springtime, baby. Take that. It's 2nd uh, Ezra 16. And, uh, 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 I'm start at 37, but the point is at 40, but since it's 37, because it goes to plays, too. It says, uh, uh, shit. That's how I be, right? Every time I see the script, I just want to read the whole chapter. Yeah, just read it, read it all. Yeah, well, not all, but read a lot of it. I'm going to read it. Uh, let me start at uh, 32. It says, The earth shall be laid waste, and the fields thereof shall be old. The earth shall be laid waste. Laid waste? I be talking all messed up. The, earth, the Lord, gonna, he going to lay the earth waste. So, I mean, the viruses, like we said, that's just the beginning of sorrows. All these wars fin to come. Oh, why this virus is popping off the United States over there doing attacks on, on Iran? There ain't nobody paying attention to that one. That's going to be beautiful. Go ahead. It says, uh, In the fields of thereof shall wax old, and her ways and all her paths shall grow full of thorns, because no man shall travel there, there and through. The virgins. Oh, they full of the thorns now, the, 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 the contaminated people. So, Ain't nobody want to go through nowhere because it, it was all contaminated. So, That's some thorns. Go ahead. The virgins shall mourn, have no bridegrooms. The women shall mourn, have no husbands. Oh, yeah, they're going to be shutting down weddings. Uh, but you going to have people dropping dead, losing their spouses. You're sending little niggas to uh, World War III and shit. Oh, yeah. Their gonna, husband's going to die. We're going to laugh. We got we to make y'all remember that part. Go ahead. There's no, there's going to be no protection for you. Oh yeah! As soon as cops ain't gonna be answering 911 soon, so the women, the women, y'all better stay at home. Y'all gonna be getting snatched up. Yeah. Brother, I know the video. Of, I guess when the Obama became president, I guess it was like niggas riding, uh, yeah. or whatever. Niggas stopping people, and then the bitch in the car, and they was trying, they would pull her out the car, trying to make her show her titties. And, I've already seen the cops. They said something about the cops are telling a lot of people that they can't respond. They too, they got their hands full. So you can see the rapes going up, bro. There's gonna be a lot of women getting taken out in the streets. Shall perish because uh, of a family. 
Oh, because of a famine. See, y'all never believed a famine before until you seen it with your own eyes. See, what is faith is you believe in something that you can't see. They, they, they didn't believe it. We told them there ain't going to be no food in the stores. They didn't believe it, bro. Look, you just out here just trying to scare people. Hey, dumbass people, you want to eat people to cause Y'all want to cause fucking famine. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Because like, everybody's supposed to have, everybody's supposed to be, supposed to be loving everybody, whatever. If you was truly loving everybody, you would go to the store and buy you shit that you might, might last for a week or two. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So you so other people can get food too. And then the fucking shelves won't be so goddamn empty. But you people, oh, you want to stock up for fucking a year and get all the goddamn food. Now there's a famine in the goddamn store. They should have won straight communists on y'all and just gave out rations. You get one of these and one of these and one of these. <laughs> That's going to happen. Yep. I have one or two. I think uh, the fuck, they had the little ration cards. Or whatever the fuck it was. Yeah, ration cards. Yeah, that's why y'all lucky one, one of us is one president. <laughs> y'all get nothing. You, you we yourself, be putting bitch. people to death for being greedy. Yeah. You know what I mean? Greedy, bitch. You get greedy, bro. You off with your head. <laughs> yeah, that's like, it, remember the time of Moses when basically the Lord told him to take. Oh, just mushroom. take what take what yeah. you need for today. Yeah, that's probably what's going to happen to these people. They're probably yep. going to turn the magnets or something. Oh, that, yeah, that could happen. You're right. People get greedy, they go, they go stock up. They got six fucking tons of rice and some maggots got up in it. Or they got all this water, you know, some kind of virus got in it or something. Or anything got, or their food got moldy. Most high, you gotta understand, we dealing with the most high here. I see a bill, this is a dumbass. It was an eating my some shit. Not bill, he has a bill. He had, it was like three fucking uh, carts of uh, milk. Milk don't even last that yeah, long. Yeah, he was just over there carrying like What's he about to do? Make some cheese? Yeah. Like, all that shit gonna expire one, at all in the same time. Like, what are you doing, my guy? That's like, that's like stocking up on fucking bananas or some shit. Uh, the banana bananas don't last for a yeah. few days. That's what the dude was saying in the video. Like, what are you doing, man? <laughs> you gotta eat that shit quick. You be eating, up, eating all the cereal. Yeah. That shit's stupid. God damn. It says, uh... Uh, hear not these things and understand them. Ye servants of the Lord, behold the word of the Lord. Receive it. Believe not the gods of whom the Lord spake. Behold, the plague draw nigh on not slack. As when a woman with child in the ninth, ninth month bringing forth her son within two or three hours of her birth, great pains can pass her womb. See, that's great pain. This, for this thing that we going into this thing is going to be painful. It's going to be painful like a woman travailing in labor. Whew. Cause something's finna be born. Cause actually, eventually, we, this is all leading to the kingdom of heaven. But it's gonna take great pain to get there. No, no yeah, there it is. No pain, no gain, no shame. <laughs> it says, which which pains when the child coming forth, they slack not a moment. Even so, shall not the plagues be slack to come upon the earth, and the world shall mourn. Oh, the, the world is a mourning right now. Motherfuckers mourning, people freaking the fuck out. And then, did you did you watch Mike DeWine's, the governor's uh, speeches and shit? Oh, they had the bitch on there. It, that, that bitch helped cause panic. She's they had some scientists, the Edomite bitch, going there, and she was like, "Oh, we already probably have a hundred thousand cases in Ohio already." Yeah, that, that caused mass panic when she said that. Yeah. She said a hundred thousand when the official total was like what two hundred. Yeah, <laughs> she said a hundred thousand. Motherfuckers rushed to the store. Yeah. How the hell is a hundred? That that don't make no damn sense. Not right now. That, I could probably understand maybe. Yeah. Still not even that. Like probably in New York. That's they probably got a lot, a lot more. But yeah. the high or not yet. That's just trying to get people in panic mode. Yeah. To get them scared. Yeah. Get them to accept that martial law. Accept. The police state, except taking away your liberties, you know? That's all it is. All y'all niggas. And you can look at Mike DeWine and tell he's a devil. But this is good, though, man. This is real good. All y'all niggas are sick. Just take this chip. For real, I don't ever leave the house no way. So I'll stay at home. <laughs> it says... Sorrow shall come upon it on every side. Sorrow, man, it's fire. 
SAR gonna come on every side. Like I, it's just the virus wasn't bad enough, but now these motherfuckers making it worse. They shut down the bars and restaurants, son. I can't. That's right there. That's shutting down the whole city. That's everybody's. Most people work at restaurants and bars. That's the most jobs out here. That's crazy. Did you say Wendy's was closed? Like everything's closed. I've never seen you see Tim Hortons. I mean, tell you, yeah, Tim Hortons was closed. I went to the pizza shop, and they said they closed down. Only deliveries only. That's crazy. My people hear my word. The Lord only talking to the elect right now. And one third of Israel. Uh, make you ready to the battle and in those evils be even as pilgrims upon the earth. So, I mean, I don't know, Lord. Everybody's going to be different. You know what I'm saying? Maybe the Lord will have us in the woods. Maybe the Lord will have us. Who knows? Whatever. You, know you got to follow the Spirit. Because the Lord going to lead you in a certain direction. He can be like, oh, can't go that way. That's dangerous. He's going he gonna to guide you. You know how the spirit leads you. You can do that when you're just driving in a car. You ever be driving? You don't know where the fuck you at? Yeah. But I'm just letting the spirit lead me and take you right to the spot. It was crazy. I went to this little trail today. It was a fucking uh, nice little, uh, nice. I've never been there before. Yeah. It's nice, it's, you know what I'm saying? Like three miles all together. And I was kind of lost. I'm, like, I'm trying to get back to the car because it was trying to take it too long. I'm trying to get back so I can you know, get ready for camp. God damn, what the fuck am I at? I just cast a lot, you know what I'm saying? Like, go this way. See, there it is. Yeah. You, ca you cast a lot. Yeah. We do that all the time. You know that works. Yeah. Yeah. Them lots yeah. don't lie, boy. Yeah. Yeah. And people are experienced, they can't get shit like that. Yeah. I've been lost many a times and just be like, the spirit, I could just feel the spirit, something about this direction. Yeah. You know? That's that uh, prim the way the premonitions. The Lord give you premonitions. Says, uh, he that selleth. Oh yeah. shit! Before the corona, I told you about that dream I had like two weeks, three weeks, ago, yeah, right before the Passover, before the lockdown and everything came. I had a dream and it was coming. I seen that shit, man. Oh, go ahead. He that selleth, let him be as he that feeleth the way. He that buyeth as one that will loose. He that occupies. Merchandise is he that hath not profited by it. Pretty much the same thing saying in First Corinthians, I believe, which says, use the world, not abuse it. He says, uh, and he that buildeth as he that should not grow therein, he that soweth as if he should not reap, reap like it. So shall, like it. so also he that plants the vineyard as he that should not gather the grapes. They that marry as though they should not get no children, and they that marry not as the widowers. And therefore, they that labor, labor in vain, for strangers shall reap their fruits and spoil the goods, overthrow their houses and take their children captives, for in captivity and famine shall they get children. And they that occupy, uh, and they that occupy their merchandise with robbery, the more they deck their cities, their, their houses, their possessions. He said the more they deck their cities, that sounds like America, though. So, That's how they be living out here. Yeah. Their possessions and their own persons, the more will I be angry with them for, uh, for their sins, saith the Lord. Like as in whore, envy for right, honest, and virtuous woman, so shall righteousness hate iniquity. Ooh! It, ooh, read that part again. It said as a whore hates a righteous woman. Like as a whore, and envy is... You see that one of these whores, they, they get mad when they see a good woman. You know what I mean? That's just like when people see us, you know? Because we're, we're good, <laughs> we're good, wholesome, and righteous. That sounds terrible. But yeah, we try to be our best, you know what I mean? We try to be our best to be righteous. We try to be our best to follow this word. Where everybody else out here, they just out of control. They just out of control of, of, with dealing with Satan on the left-hand path, you know what I mean? Just evil as hell. And they look at us and they hate, because really they, cause they get ashamed when they look at it. We out here teaching, and they get ashamed, you know, so they, they, they come at us. That's crazy. That's yeah, read that's a what scripture what number is that one? 1649. 16. 1649? 16. 16, yeah. Read that one again. Like that's a, a good one. As a whore envy of the right honest and virtuous woman. As a whore envy of the right honorable and virtuous woman. Damn. So shall righteousness hate iniquity when she death of herself and shall 
the accuse her to her face. That's what we're doing. So sorry. Righteousness, hate, iniquity. When she decked herself, we, we hate it because they, they continue to build and continue to, to stockpile the food. She looks like we just hate you, motherfuckers, man. The more y'all deck yourself and shall accuse her to her face for doing, right in front of the motherfuckers, hey, ain't nobody here today. Everybody's gone now, but yeah. They got a corona scare. It's and it was some people out here earlier. Yeah. They go two juicy ones over there for you. Yeah, it's a little too much juice right now. It's about 250, 300. Drowning that motherfucker. <laughs> he said, when he cometh that shall defend him that diligently search out every sin upon earth. And therefore be ye not like therefore unto, nor to the works thereof. For yet a little in iniquity shall, shall be taken out of the earth. Righteousness shall reign among them. Yeah, righteous is going to reign. At the end of all this shit, the righteousness is going to reign. The Lord going to bring his kingdom in. And this kingdom got to be destroyed first. We had the be beginning of it get going down. You can see the shit going down. The markets is collapsing. Everything is collapsing. Society is collapsing. The whole global fucking, fucking civil, what do you call it? Civilization. The whole, everything is collapsing. The whole goddamn world's on lockdown. Canada shut down. Yeah, Canada shut their shit. Shut their borders. Russia closed. Russia shut their shit a long time ago. It was on top of it. They said they closed their shit down until May. I had this like 9.40 a.m. RT this morning. It says U.S. stocks crash as Fed action fails to clean markets. Oh, they... That's happening right now, isn't it? Yeah. They crashing even farther? Yeah. That's, yeah, because the feds cut the, uh, the interest rates. That was yesterday they did that, and that didn't even help. Damn, they say how much is going down? I'll have to look at that when we up out of when we leave Canada. I was just doing some work. I had time to really look at it. Chaos bears, no one, the stars, that's, that's like a sport, stars, politicians, and Hollywood A listers are affected. Uh, COVID 19 can finally slash Britain's loaded overseas aid. A lot of money should go to saving lives, not juggling the boss. Uh, <laughs> let me see. India closes type. The Taj Mahal. And, uh, yeah. It's that big ass building. It's like a palace. Yeah. Other mon mon monuments over corners. Oh yeah, that, that must, this shut down. The, well, not shut down, but uh, you seen that? Uh, what's the shit that that stupid ass rocking down? Elon Musk be worship. Not Elon Musk, but Ishmael be worshiping or whatever. Oh, the Kaaba. Yeah, that bitch was empty as fuck. Nobody trying to worship that. Ain't nobody touching that stone now. That motherfucking stone got Corona on that motherfucker. <laughs> All them germs on that rock, bro. Everybody done touched it, you yeah. know? So, That's germ central right there. Yeah. It says, tragic consequences. 21-year-old Spanish football coach dies. Yeah, bitch. Man, See, I tell you, not only old people can die from it. They say that's a misconception. Not only old people die from it. They have people in their 30s and 40s uh, catching this shit. I seen some little kid died today. He just got real in Moscow. Moscow, how the fuck? Moscow. Outdoor events, bands, schools closed, indoor crowds restricted. Uh, another one, Las Vegas. That's, that's literally back to back to back. Props to come back. Yeah. This is Las Vegas NFL draft. And they it's, shut down. The, they already shut down the NBA season. It says extra. Bro, if you play fucking 2K online right now, there is no audience on the game. Sorry. You get, well, that's crazy, ain't it? Sorry. Ross Vegas canceled due to coronavirus. What does that say? Uh, something, fucking draft, something. Um, I can't pronounce that shit. Uh, NFL plans trip down alternative, whatever, blah, blah. Well, I seen the XFL cancer. Uh, you know the XFL? Nope. There's that Vince McMahon shit. They canceled. It was their first season ever. They just canceled the season. They canceled everything. Bro. Shut, shut. That's crazy. But Portugal shut the shit down too? Hell yeah, that's right by Spain. Spain shut the fuck down. Sorry. 
I heard in the UK, they said they was planning just to let everybody just spread it. They're shut. I don't know if that's still true. I, that's what I read last night. But they was just going to let everybody just spread it so everybody can become immune to it. Says Dude, what about New York City, though, bro? Ooh, that's got to be a nightmare right now. There's so many people stacked on top of each other in New York City. Bro, that shit going to spread like wildfire. Oh, that's the only good thing about when the economy collapses, the oil gets cheap. Because, you know, every time the economy gets bad, the oil's cheaper. It's because it's supply and demand. The demand for it is down. Can't nobody fucking travel. Yeah, that's, that's a good thing for a bad thing. It's a good thing for a bad thing. Second yeah. after 16 and 21, it says, Oh, uh... Oh, virtual shop be so good, cheap upon Oh, earth. yeah, victuals. Victuals, yeah, it's like water. Uh, but virtual shop be so good, cheap upon earth, that they shall think themselves to be in good case. Even then, shall evils grow upon earth, short family, and great confusion. Yeah, oh, I think the food's still cheap now, too. They go, what do they start jacking up prices? I said, Christian, somebody, they said $80 for a roll of uh, toilet paper. I don't know where that was at, though. There's a lot of people on Facebook Marketplace trying to sell toilet paper on water. They actually get in trouble for it. But it's going to come to a point, though, when the, the, the demand is going to be so high, they're going to have to raise prices. That's just the way the shit works. And then they start doing rations. Oh, then they're going to be like, oh, if you want to get this food, you're going to have to get this microchip. They can this microchip, it can monitor everything. It can monitor... If whether you got the virus or not, you know what I'm saying? Got your health information on it. Like a year ago, shit, they 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 fingerprint motherfuckers so certain people won't take so much of. It was like a what's it called? Ration. Yeah, the ration. So some one family won't get too much of fucking milk or whatever. You fingerprint your black ass, man. So that's gonna that's just gonna lead to the chip. Oh, uh, so you gonna, you gonna check how much food you get. Oh, do you see these new garbage ass IDs? I just got my new ID in the mail. Where did I, did I lose it already? <laughs> that shit trash. It's trash. It feels like it's made out of paper. Yeah. Oh, that's my old. Man, don't tell me I left it in the car. I hope I didn't lose it. Oh, here it is. It's, it's all flimsy and shit. Look. Fill this. Here's a new one. Don't look at my... Y'all gonna get my numbers. <laughs> oh, but look. It's totally different. It says not for federal. Where'd my other one go? I done lost it. What the fuck I do with it? Fill this one. Hold up. I'm tripping. Can't find my old. Uh, got your old. This shit is weird. It's way different. They've been. They changing. They've been. That tells me something's changing in the government. Oh, here it is. Let's feel the difference. It's a piece of junk. This ain't not gonna last two months. I mean, it's thinner than a Kroger card. Like. So it says not for federal ID. So soon you go to federal bill, you gotta have the uh, the federal ID, right? Soon you're gonna have to have the microchip. So there ain't gonna be no more IDs. Plus, with all the problem with the money, uh, they can be like, oh, money's helping spread the virus. We're gonna have to get rid of cash. Yeah, and then he said that in China, they yep. were hoarding all the money for like 14 days. So they're gonna spread it. Some money that was like really deep in the, in the spot that was affected, they just, I think they just burned it. They're gonna look, yeah, German. They're gonna have all kinds of excuses why they're gonna need that chip. They gonna maybe just read the chip scripture. I mean, that's what we heading it. That's what we going right into, bro. 
it's gonna be total control. Cause you actually think after this virus thing is over, you think they're gonna give all all the so-called freedoms right back to us? They gonna keep some shit on lock. Cause they gonna get y'all they gonna get y'all prepared. They preparing y'all to get used to being on lockdown. That's what they're doing. This is the new normal right here. Don't think this is just a few weeks. It's going to last a few weeks. This is the new normal. It's going to blow over. It's going to blow over, okay. It's going to blow over in your face. It says, uh, it says, uh, Revelation 13, 16, because of all both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. So that's what we're going to the the market of the microchip. You're not going to be able to buy or sell none without that microchip. Like I said, it's going, that microchip is going to have your whole life on it. It's going to have your bank account on it. It's going to have your health information on it, whether you infected or not. You know what I mean? It could probably they probably they've been taking so long to push the chip out. The chip going to have all kind of features. It probably be able to take your temperature and everything, get your vitals and stuff off your chip. I got to scan that chip real quick. It's going to have your money on It's going to have everything on there. GPS locator to track your ass down so you can't get away. Like I said, the food shortages, they, they do, and the, the bank's collapsing too. They're going to chip everybody. They're going to try to. She can take a picture. It's like that. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. We could do this some, some, some pictures. Yeah, we got to go to my house to do that. As long as she ain't got no corona. Yeah, yeah. yeah the, the article back in the day, not back in the day, it's like a week or two ago, it said the money would be more than not worth the spray the virus when she goes to Yep. You know what I'm saying? So what's this? The technology is always going to get better and better and better. First, now you got the little phone. You can Shit. Well, first, what was the first? First was he could pay with your card. Then it went to uh, the chip on the card. Yeah, chip on the card. Now it's your phone. And yeah, now you use the phone. Now yeah. you go, I guess they got Amazon got stores where you can just walk in. Yeah. Put it in your little bag and just walk out. Look at that new shit. Now it is only gonna get. It's gonna get. It, it, look, phones. Phones used to be big. And but shit. you can steal phones though. Yeah. You can't steal a microchip or somebody. Yeah. Because they'll look at that because they're going to look at security is the most important thing. When you got that microchip, that's the most secure thing there is. And you can get someone's phone and their password, you have access to all their accounts and everything. That's just beautiful, man. I don't think your boy coming, is he? Who are these people, yo? Don't be coming around me. They're down here cleaning up, cleaning up that corona. Oh, your boy got bread. Where you get that at? They, they said there's, there's like no bread in the stores and nothing. They, they see people with food, bro. They people will start looking at you funny. You better hide that food. Don't let everybody see it. You gonna get, bro? You be walking down the street, you gonna get beat up for Kroger groceries. I can see it happening. You can, people gonna start getting mugged walking home from the grocery store. You gonna get beat up. They gonna take your groceries. It's covered. Yeah, I, I just I just seen it clear as day. Come on, give me them Kroger white boy pal. Beat your ass. Man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy their house with the sword. World of good because of the lack of bread for great tribulation. Yes. Read that again. Yeah. It was all kind of loud out here. A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor. Yeah, a man shall have no pity upon his neighbor. Go ahead. No, God, no pity. It's not like the bus is farted. Yeah. No nasty ass. So, man, they're going to shut the Coda bus down, bro. Remember when the government shut down? They, they, they was about to shut down. Oh, the Coda? Yeah. yeah. Man, the Coda bus go down, bro. It's over. It's a wrap. Because you know them Coda bus drivers, they, they paranoid as hell. I wouldn't go to work, bro. All them nasty heathens be on the bus. You see some nasty people on the bus. 
they just be in there stinking, breathing. They be in there on the... I was scared before the coronavirus. Shit. Damn, that's the perfect scripture for that. And which one is that? Second Ezra 15 and 19. Second Ezra 15 and 19. Yeah, because people they gonna get people they gonna get the shit be that I'm just you walking down the street with a bag of groceries and somebody sees you. Asian niggas became new niggas. Oh, they did, didn't they? Yeah. Overnight. Why? Wow, so that shit gonna get worse. They they gonna start beating their ass. Oh, this, this is an Asian nigga. They gonna, they gonna probably fucking it, kill it, They feel like they gotta blame it on somebody. Yeah. Hey. Now it's every goddamn body. You come from Europe. You, you got the fucking virus. You came yeah. from Africa. You probably got the virus. That's why I said, though, everybody looking at each other funny right now. You, I was at the grocery store. I see everybody just... Everybody looking at the next person like they the enemy. It ain't no brotherly love, that's for sure. Motherfuckers ain't trying to help each other get through it. Everybody looking at each other funny, like, you know what I mean? What's up, Kirk? Man, I should've got that on camera, bro. This dude walking all kind of crazy. What? That, man, that's the most high, bro. That should make you fear the most high right there. Yeah. You see something like that? Yeah. You should fear the most high. The dude was walking all fucked up. Looked like he had a pole shoved up his ass. But he was like he's messed up or something. <laughs> most high is terrifying, man. they got right now. Everybody just returned from overseas to a back to America. You see the, uh, uh, they showed the airports, like, they worried about large groups coming together, but they showed that, was it, Chicago airport and other airports? All, all the Americans was forced to come back to this country and that they was all on top of each other, just packed like sardines in the airports. They was stuck in there for like eight hours. So it was crazy. I bet all kind of people got corona up in there. Oh, because everybody that came back to America, they had to get tested or whatever. They had to run a temperature. So you're going to be seeing check. I can, you can see checkpoints. Cops going to stop you. You know, take your temperature or whatever. Oh, you got the corona, bro. You thrown in the camp with the rest of the people. Need you to come with me. Need you, yeah, you to come with us. I'm being detained. Look at that. That's what they're going to be saying. Fucking Jay. Oh, I know my rights. Stupid ass. No time, Jake, well, there ain't no rights no more. You see what they did with your rights? There ain't no fucking rights. They just they just forced business owners to shut down their businesses. Where's your right? What's the rights in that? Martial law, you ain't got no rights. Exactly. Rights suspended. Your shit through. The little rights that you did have, that shit gone. Yeah. You got the right to remain silent. Not no more. Boy, I don't know what the fuck. That shit trash.
Look at these boys. In every place. That, that fucking virus is hitting, bro. This motherfucker worldwide. And if the virus is like, he's like, I'm out here. Yeah, <laughs> Corroded over there, like, I'm out here. What's good? <laughs> he's like, the champ is here. The champ is here. The champ is here. <laughs> that is literally in every country, man. It's crazy too how Italy got fucked up more than anybody. You know, we'll be beside China, I think. So, you wouldn't even think Italy. That's crazy. <laughs> you know there's a lot of wicked demons in Italy. Shit. You see that nigga from Brazil that got he got he got tested for the shit, he got he got uh I think about, I don't know if it was the president or fucking one of the Oh yeah, I say him the health he was a health guy. Oh yeah, man. He was talking to the president and shit. Yeah. Nigga, he got it. Hey, so some people in the White House probably got that shit. Yeah. Hey, how y'all doing? Good. Yes, sir. Oh, they claim Trump took a test, but they said he wasn't infected. But they can just lie about that, you know? I don't think he's he probably ain't infected because he probably won't, they probably wanna fucking make the shit. So he already probably got the cure and shit. Yep. So you know he saw he be on that shit. <laughs> yeah, they, you gotta get your temperature checked before you go in the White House. It's funny though how a lot of famous people catching it. And the famous people, they in contact with more people than their average person. <laughs> do, do you have more of that scripture to read? I just seen something I wanted to get into. Uh, <laughs> I could read all this. I'm just gonna start at, uh. Damn. I don't even know where to start. I'm gonna start at 32, that's so good, but. Do Deuteronomy 32 and 32. Just talking about y'all people out here. For their vine is of the vine of Sodom and the fields of Gomorrah. Their grapes are grapes of gall, their clusters are bitter. That's talking about two thirds of Israel. That's talking about our people. These people out here, they're wicked and evil, bro. They, they sprung up a divine of Sodom and Gomorrah. You know, adulterers, adulteresses, homosexuals, <laughs> demons, selfish ass, greedy ass people. Oh, selfish, greedy, simple, bird brain ass people. Low IQ. <laughs> Low IQ head having ass. <laughs> Said their wine is the poison of dragons and the cruel venom of ass. Is not this laid up in store with me and sealed among my treasures? To me belongeth vengeance and recompense. Their foot shall slide in due time. For the day of their calamity is at hand. And the things that shall come upon them make haste. That virus making haste. It's spreading quick. That virus ain't playing. It's making haste. For the Lord shall judge his people and repent himself for his service when he saith that their power is gone and there's none set up or left. Uh, and that's pretty much the point. I could go on forever. I just wanted to bring that out. It, the, it said, For the day their calamities at hand and the things that shall come upon them make haste. And that's making haste right now. It's all punishments for breaking the commandments of the Lord. Not putting your faith in the Lord. Y'all is not out here crying on the Lord. You know what I'm saying? What is the scripture? Isaiah, none pleaded for justice and seek of truth. Ain't nobody out here doing that. These people, they just into a bunch of foolishness, man. And I wonder what Pastor's is doing at the churches. Oh, all the churches are closed. Like, what do you say? Where's their faith? Where's your faith? Wow, well, where's your healing? I thought they could heal. Healer, healer, healer. What happened to the healer, healer, healer? Where's your healing powers go, bro? Y'all, they're healing. Heal the corona. 
We'll see Benny Hinn hit the corona with his jacket. <laughs> I know you've seen the Benny Hinn video. Is he still alive? Yeah. He still do that shit? Because you know the Jake, the Jake pastors, all these little hood churches, you know pastors in them churches ain't got no answers. Oh, they over there coughing with a mask on. Corona alert. Oh, he said, he said, read that again. He said, you to forsake me, I'll forsake you. Desire me to be gracious unto you, I shall have no mercy upon you. Right, all of a sudden, y'all want the Lord to be gracious unto you. Oh, because now you catching hell. Shit's getting rough. Now you ain't got no water. You ain't got no ramen. You, you know? Now you ain't got no toilet paper. Now you crying. Lord, please save me. Get the fuck out of here. That's the, you gonna hear the biggest fuck out of here you ever heard in your life. Fuck you. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. <laughs> fuck out of here with this shit. He already said it. I ain't hear from you. Your, your black ass is fucking here, motherfucker. Yeah. Where you <laughs> yeah, that's like your uh, yeah, your friend. You know how people never call certain friends until they need something? Yeah. That's what that's these motherfuckers. They don't call the most high until they need something from him. Yeah. It, it's like your cousin that call you just when he need money, you know? Yeah. He know he's on drugs. Yeah. All of a sudden he calling you. Yeah, that's just got it, motherfucker. Yeah, that's these people when they call the most high. He's like you raggedy motherfuckers. Y'all ain't talked to me in how long? Now you want me to help you? You was just on the streets last week making fun of my profits, you know? It says, it says, uh, it says, uh, wherefore, I mean, yeah, somebody else might tell you I'm gonna have no mercy on you, bro. That's, that's the most high that said that. That's crazy, bro. That's like bro. that's the most high that said that. Mercy, man. That means Lord let let loose on the ass. Man. No Not mercy. Ain't, ain't that reggae song? Yeah. Somebody's like, no mercy. I don't know where they came from. Crazy, no mercy shall be shown. That's like, like that's like that's like that's one of the mercy. That's like say. Uh, you're like, still going at still, yeah. You're still going. Now, now they on the ground. They unconscious. You still stomping their head. No like, mercy. no mercy, motherfucker. I see videos that motherfucker. Motherfucker. Nigga, stomp this nigga in his head. Hit the concrete. That nigga already knocked out. They still kicking. Still stomping. Women crying. Blood, nigga. Dripping. Still ain't so no mercy. That's how the most high gonna do, yo. Yeah, he, man, he gonna kill men, women, children. It don't matter. What's that? <laughs> that ain't done. Now it's like, look, 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 have not as it were forsaken me but your own self saith the Lord. Alright, so y'all already forsaken your own selves. That's why this whole shit's going on. We could have been in the kingdom of heaven if y'all wouldn't act like a bunch of heathens. Damn heathens. We could have been in the kingdom. Y'all, you know what I mean? Just do what the hell you're told. Bunch of niggas. It's like the promised land. We would have been in like the promised land. It was time of Egypt. We would have been in the promised land 40 years. Oh yeah, we had to wait an extra 40. Yeah, we had to wait at 40 because of y'all. Wicked generation have to die off. This is gonna happen again. But this time ain't gonna be no forty years. Hey, gonna make a quick, uh, speedy riddance. He gonna make a speedy riddance. A quick work. <laughs> it says, uh, "Thus saith the Almighty Lord, Have I not prayed you, as a father his son, as a mother his daughter, and a nurse her young babes, that you will be my people, and I shall be your God, that you should." This is a modern day Egypt shit. And, uh, I should be a father. I gathered you together as a man gathered with the chickens and the meat. But now, what shall I do with you? I will cast you out from my face. If you offer unto me, I will uh, turn my face from you for your 
their solemn, these solemn feast days, the new moons, the circumcisions. I got to say, I sent out to you my servants, the prophets, whom ye have taken and slain and torn their bodies in pieces, whose blood I will require of your hands, saith the Lord. That said, oh, what the Lord said, the blood of the prophets is going to be upon all you, or the hands. What he said, Luke. I think he said, Luke. He said, the blood of the prophets is going to be on all y'all motherfuckers' hands. Something like that. God, he said it, I mean, we get to the point too, like when they start microchipping people, they might try to force you to take the chip, or you, like take the chip, we're gonna kill you or put right. you in prison yeah. or something, you know? Revelation 20 said, they had beheaded, they didn't wanna take the chip. Because you know they're gonna have some harsh, they're gonna have some forcible shit, they're gonna be forcing people to do some shit. You know they could probably force vaccinations, force all kind of shit. So I can see him forcing that chip. Says, "Thus said the Lord Almighty, your house is destined. I will cast you out as the wind of stubble. And your children shall not be fruitful, for they shall be happy. For they have despised my commandment." See, they did not. They have despised the commandment. Go ahead. Now, what's the commandments? Y'all don't even know the commandments, bro. Cause they, cause the Christians, they think a sin is some shit they made up, some they thought they was wrong in their heart. But these people don't get the commandments in the Bible. Obviously, you do got the Ten Commandments: Thou shalt not steal, not kill, don't commit adultery. You're supposed to keep the Sabbath. Y'all, there's a commandment say you're not supposed to eat pork. They say you're not supposed to get tattoos. There's commandments that say a man's supposed to grow his beard out. But the people is not following the commandments out here. But now y'all reaping the benefit, the reward. What is that uh, saying? You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. You don't follow the commandments, you gonna win a stupid ass, dumb ass prize. Stupid. Yeah, you why you <laughs> you don't watch the SML, do you? That uh <laughs> But they got this that Asian, it's like a puppet thing. It's it's funny as hell. But they got this Asian teacher on there, he be like, why you stupid? Why you dumb? You so stupid. Why you dumb? That the name of this, they got a school they go to, it's called Why You Dumb. I don't know why that's so funny to me. But why are y'all so stupid, man? These people out here are so dumb. See the Lord with bodily eyes, we still believe that's faith right there. This is it now, brother? Oh, what glory to see the people that come from the east. And to whom I will give for me this Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Isaiah's, Amos, Marcus, Joel. That's all the prophets. Yeah, Jonas, Nahum, Abba, 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 this is the king of Greek. Yeah. Sophias, Agrius, whatever, Zachariah. They just naming all the major minor prophets. Yeah, which is part of also the angel of the Lord. Man, the back today. They're saying they out here somewhere. We're well, the prophets. We've been prophets. That way, we are the prophets. He looked at me like, huh? That's ridiculous. We've been out in the prophets. A prophet is somebody who prophesies. The word prophet comes from the Latin, which means to say before, say something before it happens. Bro, we've been told you there's going to be a virus outbreak years ago. We've been saying for years they're going to do this. They're going to lock shit down. There's going to be a virus. They're going to lock the shit down. There ain't going to be no food in the stores. We've been telling y'all that. Every week we mention that. Damn near every week we just, you're going to go to the store. There ain't going to be no food. We've been telling y'all that. So that, we're prophets. We predicted that. We didn't predict it because it was in the scriptures. We knew it was going to happen. 
Oh, we just get that scripture of the Lord, the sign of the times and all that. You know, when the sign of the times, they, these people, they can't discern the sign of the times. They thought everything was good. Y'all thought y'all's lives was good. You thought every day was going to continue on as normal. But it didn't, did it? And we told y'all that your everyday normal life was going to stop. We told you that. You didn't believe us. We just some crazy fools on the corner. Oh yeah, so y'all can't you can't discern discern the sign of the time. You see the cloud coming and you know it's about to rain. Y'all should have seen this shit happening. You know, if you pay, if they don't pay attention to the news. These people don't watch the news. If they do, they watch some cable shit, some Fox or CNN. You know what I mean? These people don't know what's going on out here. They're a bunch of mental retards. They not, they don't read the scriptures. They're not following after the Lord. They're not seeking after righteousness. So what did that say? No more to that. They can't discern. They, can, they didn't see it coming. We seen this coming. Eric, these people, they ain't see it coming. Why they didn't see it coming? Because they're blind. When you blind, you can't see shit. And y'all still blind. And you're going to fall right into that pit full of spikes. Go right through your eye. Right through your head. They said, okay, I see you see that one, huh? You like that one, huh? Guilty. But she was looking at us, she looked, the fine ass bitch, but she looked at us like we was trash. Hey, you fucking gold, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Scripture says, uh, the <laughs> Yeah, we go, bro. Scripture says, uh, the man's gonna be as gold as, uh, gold as Ophar, whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? When so, that time comes, we just yeah. gonna take the pussy. Yeah, yeah. Hey, they gonna come to us. They, they gonna come to all the time. Let's get it. Give me the Isaiah 13. Yeah. Oh, uh, really? Uh, you know what I'm talking about? The gold of Ophar? Wait, that's a Zach Ryle also. Oh, yeah, I think you're talking about the man that's going to be his goal. Yeah. Hey, man, so, hey, this my scripture says uh, that the Lord, he's going to show his power, roughly perfect, uh, wisdom of Solomon 12. He's going to show his power, and that's going to make everybody believe his power. But it's also the people that already, already knew his power is going to make their face as boldness. Because these prophecies are going to come to pass. So all these pestilences are coming, so that seven women take on one man. Hey, look, take, all... Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to cut you. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, go ahead. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. Bro, all these women are losing their jobs. They all work in restaurants or waitresses. They're going to need a man. They're going to need that money. Y'all going to need that paper. Oh. Oh, the man, we, we out there working. You know what I mean? So the woman, they're going to need that money. They gonna be hurt. Oh, I need somebody to feed my kids. I need to feed my babies. Well, you shouldn't have left your husband. Now, now you out there. Now you caught out there. But a lot of these women, like the scriptures, they gonna come to. Us. They gonna have, got no money, got no food. They gonna have to. But I was like, you got bow, bow, bitch. Say, call me Lord. Huh? You about to rain? Camera's about to die anyway. They're going to rain Corona on y'all. <laughs> this is fun out here, man. I'm your Lord, bitch. Oh, yeah. We just ain't taking bitches back, bro. When y'all come running to us, you got you to gotta, you gotta say some things. You need to humble yourself. Yeah, there's gonna be an order to this. There's gonna be an order about it. Yeah, and even even if some bitches are gonna be turned down. Some bitches might, yep. she might be bad as fuck, but it's gonna be all through the spirit. Yeah, the yep. spirit don't want that bitch. Yeah. Cause you just look at it and look in her eyes to see if she real or not. You yeah. know, You're like get get out my face, you filthy. Fuck out my face. Fuck out my face. Stupid bitch. Hey, I heard. I heard a long time ago. I already brought it out before, but just a couple years ago, I had a dream. Walking down the street, whatever, and I had red. Some niggas came up to me and like, what's up, man? They thought, I, think, I guess they thought I was a blood. Oh, 
Yeah. Like, what's up, Flood? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's up, cuz? You know what I'm saying? But I forgot what they were saying, but yeah. it was like, you know, they're like, what's up? The dude, he shot me with a shotgun, and it was like, it did nothing to me. I was like, damn. I was like, damn, nigga, what's up? And then, everybody was bugging us, oh, shit. I was like, yeah, oh, keep, keep shooting. You seen, you seen that movie, uh, uh, Jail? Nah, I haven't seen it. I want to see that. Cause that movie, that movie funny as fuck. It's cool. The movie Shazam, that scene when he was in the, uh, they was in the store, and the dude, he didn't know, he didn't know he was like boop at first, and the dude shot him and shit, and he was like, oh shit, and he's like, oh, keep shooting me, keep, they was, he was making a joke out of it and shit, that's yeah. what I was doing in the dream, I was like, yeah, keep shooting me, motherfucker, and then he kept shooting me, and everybody was bugging me, I'm like, oh my god, it's a miracle and shit, and then that's when, uh, it was like, it was like hella, uh, Latin tribe bitches, they all, it was like, it was like a big ass group of them, they all was like there, and they was just all king, they all stood behind me and shit, you know what I'm saying? It's like following me and shit. And then after that, it was another brother. He was out there teaching Matthew 5 to people. It, it was crazy, man. It was, it was bugged out. So that's the seven women take over one man. Because they gonna, it was, the script says the, they gonna be ruling the day of that power. Oh, oh see, let me get that. Yeah. Once they see, like, oh shit, this nigga invisible, goddamn. So he gonna start coming to us. Like, oh shit, man, I need, you know, I need, I need somebody to save me. Somebody save me. You know what I'm saying? Somebody save me. I said for a woman, in that day, in that day, seven women shall take hold of one man, saying we will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by that name to take away our reproach. Called by that name. Oh, but when you take on a woman, she's supposed to take on your name. That's why they still got the custom too, where you take, a woman takes the man's last name. Now you, these days, you got men taking a woman's last name. And the men's been turning to bitches out here. Shit, now you got men, they saying they're women. That's the new thing. You got trannies out here. Trannies running rampant. You, you see them LGBT, whatever the fuck. They had, they had a two at the end. Oh, yeah. Like the Q. The LGBTQ? Yeah. Or, yeah. It's LGBTQ. At the end, it's two. A two? Yeah. What the fuck does that mean? They both. It's, they like, both? it's like free spirit or some shit. I don't know what the fuck it is. I That's some weirdo shit, man. I think it's some native. They done took the whole goddamn alphabet for that shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, what do you say? L G B T Q. <laughs> God damn. It's some weirdo shit. It's just been cool to be a weirdo. And that's why that's why the Lord's slowing it down. Y'all see he's gonna slow y'all shit down. Take it too far, baby. Yeah, y'all gonna move it too fast. Now they shutting down on the bars. All them gay clubs and all them uh clubs and shit, discos, whatever you call that shit. That's just all getting shut down. It's shut down in Ohio. DeWine just put out an executive order. He shut that shit down, son. Ain't no club. Ain't no going to no clubs. Y'all got. Y'all got. He just made everybody have a seat. He said y'all gotta have a seat, and y'all just had that seat. Yes, master. He's like yes, master. Yeah. You know the bitches mad and can't go to the club, boy. Whew. Oh, they're gonna be on. Uh, they're gonna be on the internet. They're gonna be feeding for that D. And they ain't gonna have no jobs because they're losing their jobs. P2P. Uh, P2P. It's gonna be. They're gonna have to pay us now. Shit. You know that's where we get to. Oh, they ain't gonna have no money though. So we just gonna have to take care of them. But I got, baby, I got some ramen over here. Come on over. <laughs> Bro, these bitches suck a dick from ramen now. I think they already been doing that though. Yeah, for week. I told you I seen a bitch on this dating thing. She said, "I don't want nothing too serious." I'm, she's like, "I'm not asking for a lot. I just want you to buy me a double cheeseburger at McDonald's." She pretty much said she she'll suck your dick for a cheeseburger. Like this is real. I was thinking about it for maybe just a cheese like that. <laughs> Just like that. Get a happy meal. Like that. You know, I don't eat McDonald's, bro. That yeah, but McDonald's is shut. All these fat people can't get their McDonald's. They freaking. Wow. It says Psalms 110. The Lord said unto my Lord, Sit down my right hand till I make thine enemies thy footstool. The Lord shall send the rod of thy strength out of Zion, rule thou in the midst of thine enemies. Oh, that's what we're going to be doing in the kingdom. We're going to be ruined in the midst of our enemies. But the Lord going to put over our enemies under our feet. 
uh, Psalms 58 said we're going to wash our feet in the blood of the wicked. Look, thy people shall be willing in the day thy power and the beauties of holiness from the womb in the morning thou hast to do with thy youth. So the people, they're going to be willing in the day, when the Lord gives us power, then that people going to be willing. Then that's when everybody's going to follow us. Like you said with the woman. The woman's only going to follow whoever got the money. If you ain't got no woman, if you ain't got no money, the woman don't care about you. Okay? <laughs> the woman only care about money, security, and comfort. And now they ain't gonna have no money. Bitches losing their jobs over this coronavirus. Yeah, people like back in the day, you know back in the day, the man the father would tell, oh, you gonna marry this motherfucker. Yeah. Man. But and people look at it today, nowadays, they're like, oh shit, that's so wrong. What about love? What about love? You motherfuckers don't got love. Y'all people y'all still do that shit to this day. They have a new husband every year. They yeah. get a new marriage. I'm gonna marry God. I'm gonna marry this. Yeah. It's the same shit back in the day. We think we the father was like, oh, this this is a prince. I'm gonna marry you to a prince. He got money. It's the same shit. Oh, yeah, a woman should have no choice. It is better that the parents should arrange something. You know, that's better, because it works out better. Because they, they're older or more responsible than you. They know better. They know what's going to be good for you. But not these parents these days. They dumb as hell. But us, us, if we had children, we would know what was good for our children. They'd be like, no, this bitch ain't no good for you. Like, she already had 10 dicks in her. We already know. Well, now get take this one. She's a virgin. Say, this is what you need, son. My son. I want my sons to get with virgins. I don't want my sons to get with a whore. You know? Why would you do that to your children? And then in a woman, the woman raised their daughters up to be whores. They tell them to go test the waters. And if a woman's with a man and they're going through some rough stuff, just like, oh, y'all just need to leave that motherfucker. Leave his bitch ass, his broke bitch. You know what I mean? That's how they talk. It's crazy, though. It's like every relationship goes through some bullshit. Like exactly. Every relationship goes through some so you gonna tell me as soon as something bad happens, you automatically gotta leave? Like, oh, right. Man. Like, well, I grew up with my brothers. You can get in a fight with our brothers. We bust each other's noses open. But then we still brothers, though. You still my family. I'm not gonna say, oh, you're not my brother no more. We're just gonna end this. Because when you, yeah, well, that's the same thing. A woman's your family. She's gonna stop being your family all of a sudden. Fuck these bitches. It's like you had one bad argument with your child. You just gonna, just gonna disown the motherfucker? Exactly. Unless it turns into a faggot, maybe I'll do that then. But if it's something like that, it's something else. You ain't gonna Dwayne Wade him? Yeah. Oh. Oh, disown that motherfucker. That's the only time I'll do it. That's the worst thing. That's the worst possible. I don't think the Lord would do that to us. The Lord willing. I, we pray on that one. That's something you pray about. Please don't let my son be a faggot. Oh, you got that? Isaiah 13? Oh, shit. I think I lost it. Get it. Man, this whole fires. This whole I can, I've been speaking all messed up. This whole chapter is fire. This is re where am I, where am I at? I mean it's 13. You know exactly where it's at, because I want to read a lot of this actually. I'm going to just start it right here at 6, and we'll run into it. Isaiah 13 and 6. How ye for the day the Lord is at hand, it shall come as a destruction from the Almighty. Ooh, that's fire. It says, therefore shall all hands be faint, and every man's heart shall melt. Oh, they melting out here. They heart, people getting scared out here. Corona got y'all shook. Oh, I was just saying, really, you don't know about Buster Rhymes, do you? No, remember that song? He's like, woo ha! Got you all in check. You remember that? I was like, woo ha! Got you all in check. So, uh, and they shall be afraid. Pangs and sorrow shall take hold of them. They shall be in pain as a woman that travaileth. They shall be amazed of one another. Their faces shall be as flames. Behold, the day the Lord cometh cruel, both with wrath and fierce anger, to lay the land desolate. He shall de destroy the, sinner, the sinners out of it. Whew. They said the Lord, the day the Lord is cruel. It didn't say that it was the day the Lord was a loving time. 
you know, you hear the Christians tell it, they, you know what I mean? The Lord coming out of the heavens, sliding down on a rainbow, like, whew. You got bunny rabbits and animals with him. Uh, ooh, that's a fire. It said, I got to read that again. Behold, the day the Lord cometh, cruel, both with wrath and fierce anger, to lay the land desolate, and he shall destroy the sinners thereof out of it. So the Lord, he's going to destroy all y'all sinners. That means when you're breaking the laws of the Bible, like being a homosexual, that's a sin. Like that flamer that just flamed past us. Behold, oh, I just read that. For the stars of heaven and the constellations thereof shall not give their light. The sun shall be darkened and is going forth. The moon shall not cause their light to shine. Because soon then the missiles is going to come too. That, that's going to be that, that the final act right there. When that, that fire hits. The virus is like what? This is one of the... Uh, this is one of the beginning phases. The beginning of the end. Like, really, the beginning of the end already started years ago. And I will punish the world for their... Ooh, look. And I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease. I will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. This is it right you said. But we got to focus on that for a second. He said, I will cause that arrogancy and the proud to see. There's some arrogant, proud-ass people out here. They think nothing's ever, ever going to happen to them. They, 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 y'all didn't see this virus coming. Y'all ain't see, We seen it from a mile away. Y'all ain't see it when it was two feet in front of your face. You didn't see it. You know what I'm saying? Because y'all can't see shit because you're blind. That's China. Oh, yeah, that's China. Yeah, last week they were still on uh, with their stupid ass corona memes and shit. They're like it was a joke. Ha ha ha, joke. Real boy is like, me Chinese, me play joke. <laughs> you do all used to tell them jokes? The me Chinese jokes? He's like, me Chinese, me play joke. <laughs> you should say, woman with chopstick eat wisely. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that from somewhere. I'm not sure. You're probably older than me. Uh, I'll read this again. I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease. And I will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. I will make a man more precious than fine gold. Even a man than the golden wedge of Ophir. Right, the Lord gonna make the men like go. First, soon y'all women gonna be running to us, man. You're gonna be bowing at our feet, saying, "Lord, please save me," because you're gonna call us Lord. Y'all, y'all women finna lose all y'all's jobs. Y'all all work at restaurants. You work at the bars. Now y'all a bunch of broke bitches. Help me, please. I'll suck your dick. <laughs> Oh, shit. This is a nice one right there, boy. She the, see the quiet one. That's all That's the eat them white lady. All of you there. I mean, it's mad. She smacks me. Yeah, I don't know about that. That's a Judite woman. She'll probably get put to death. You can already see, though, because the woman, man, is obviously... Not equal to a man, obviously, and they need they need protection. Who the hell is gonna protect these women when the shit hit the fan? Like even my grandma. Uh, no, I said my grandma. <laughs> I'm so used to calling my mom grandma because you know when you talk to your children, you say go talk to grandma. <laughs> she gonna need somebody to protect her. You know what I mean? All these old women are grandma, your mom. You know what I'm saying? We gonna have to take care of them. It's already like that already, cause you know my mom's. You know, she, you know nobody listens. They don't listen when they when you told them the shit's coming. Okay. He's like, look, this, this shit is about to hit the fan. They don't list. They don't take you serious. They're out spending all their money on fucking decorations and women shit, wasting all. They ain't got no money to buy food or nothing. Then now you got to take care of them. You know what I'm saying? 
but Right, and that's what I'm saying, but you know. Yeah, I'm just saying, like, she, she's actually making money a lot. Almost every week, she goes and needs some shit. And that's mom. Mom always going to ask for something. She's a yeah, woman. Yeah. That's a woman. A woman is needy. She always needs something. She needs a man to, you know, to take care of her. I used to hate me. I used to hate me. Shit, I remember that shit. She's always, she's always uh buy cigarettes. We hungry as fuck. She always buy cigarettes. cigarettes. That shit's always making me mad. Man. Like man, buy some food. We hungry as fuck. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> what is this thing? Well, we, 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 we eat like we eat like some fucking dirty snacks and shit. It's like god damn, we could be eating something else. Like man, come on, like god damn, eating them damn buying them cigarettes and shit. My baby's mom did. My boys was complaining. Yeah. They struggling. They struggling now. How much more? And you know, we always every, every time mom struggles. I always call one of her little uh, baby daddies, whatever. Oh, yeah. And yeah, he gonna, he gonna be in set, he in set mode because he, he's so happy. Oh, she wants me back. Oh, this is my baby's mom. She was texting me today. She's freaking out. Oh, now you want to text me. You want that D in that protection. She knows how I get down. Because she already, we've been, ta we've been telling people about this shit for years. And now we're we don't look so crazy now. Die, bitch, die. Yeah, die, bitch. Oh, Children of whoredoms. So, when her mother had played the harlot, she that conceived them hath done shamefully. She said, I will go after my lovers first, that, that give me my bread, my water, my wool, my flax, my oil, and my drink. Damn. That's what a woman does. When, see, they, she, they always come back when times get rough. They need, especially now, like the scripture, scripture said, bro, seven women gonna take hold of one man, women gonna be coming to us. You already seen it. I know. I know people already losing their jobs. It just started last night. Cause what are the business? They got to shut down. Everybody instantly lost their job just like that. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Shit, I might lose my job. Shit, little raggedy job I got. Yep. Yeah, everything temporary anyway. Every day I'm at work anyway before this happened. I'm like, they going to fire. They're going to find out what I do. They're going to fire me. Shit, hey, screwed everybody. You don't really need a job. Right. No, you can take needles. You can take pine needles. You can take pine needles. If you need vitamin C, just boil some pine needles and drink the juice. That's some vitamin C. Now you Because if you don't get vitamin C, you're going to get scurvy. And that helps keep your immune system up. Like I said, man, the, you can eat fucking dandelions. You can eat mushrooms. You know, mushrooms pop up. You got to know which ones to get. You see, look, now y'all starting to study is a little too late. Should have been on your mushroom study game. I know a few mushrooms I can get. And then, and then and we got about another month, and mushrooms going to be popping up. Shit, we might not make it a month. Shit. You don't know what can happen in a month from right now to when spring hits. Yeah, they're all, there's going to be all kind of foods growing just everywhere around you in the spring. Whew, that's why the Lord said, pray, pray don't your flight be in the winter. This thing could be going until the winter. What if we get to the winter and they still talking? It's on total lockdown. That would be beautiful. Yeah, keep it running. You got to get nice and toned. And she got no ass at all. Yeah. I do squats. That's the type of bitch that we're doing nothing with cardio. We do some goddamn squats, bitch. I've been bitch be on uh, Facebook posting a squat video. Like, oh, yeah, get my ass. Yeah. Get my form. Yeah. yeah. Get my form right there. Yeah. It's nice right there. It's all yeah, she kinda, yeah, she got a hood look to her. She got a little spiciness in there. Oh, she, oh, she got a skate. I'll take that one. She got a skate. And she wearing chucks. Like a, uh, she, she reminds 
She's a little gangster. She got some gangster to her. That's a, that's a little feisty little whores out here. So you want to wrap it up some of this battery's about to die. We about to get up out of here. You want to get any last scriptures or anything? We said we said our piece today, man. We said what needs to be said. We said, we said everything that needed to be said. Yo, yo, Rusty Wallace looking ass. What? That's that Rusty. You don't know Rusty Wallace? There's just that's that NASCAR driver. They shutting down NASCAR too, ain't they? All right, we about to get up out of here. We're going to say Shalom.